You're listening to Social Misconduct with Mick and B-Wall, only on L.A. Talk Radio. Hi, everybody. Hi. We are back. I'm Mick, co-host B-Wall. What up? What's up? And we have a special guest today, Nash Quest. Hey, what's up, everybody? <laughs> what's going on? <laughs> oh, you know, doing well? Oh, well, well, a quick question. Uh, can you smoke in here? No. You can not I was just wondering. I was just okay, 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 okay. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, I was just, yeah. Where you're just, just going to blaze up, like, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah I'm right. just going to light it first and then yeah, be like, right, uh, yeah, yeah. so. Can we do this? Oh, sorry. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, I was, yeah, I was talking to the radio guy. And I was like, <laughs> yeah, sure, man. And anywhere under the, you know, sprinklers. <laughs> oh, my God. He's trying to, like, I'm just I'm set us on fire today. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh well nash quest um mm -hmm. if you all don't know you should know but <laughs> he's an artist and um you just released the music video i did i did this like last week last week right yeah la last week last thursday yes um, and tell everybody about that so just released a brand new music video uh it's for the song contemporary folklore which it's, is dope oh uh, thank you <laughs> um a song that i produced and wrote and uh, the video was directed by one of my good friends, Daniel Carberry. Nice. And it's, uh, I'll tell you about it, but you have to go on the you Vivo and see it. You gotta go on Vivo. <laughs> yeah, don't tell them anything. Yeah. Make them go and watch it. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's a good video. Um, B and I actually went to uh, the video release party last week. Yes, you week did. And it was fun. You know, I watched the video like a million times. So <laughs> it was good. It, was it needs a million joint. hits, though. It does. So <laughs> Vivo, Nash Quest, look that up. So. I appreciate that. Yeah, we had a good time at the at the release party. It was fun. Yeah. It was fun. I liked the location. We were right fun. on the Sunset Strip. I mean, that was perfect. Mm -hmm. Good time. Some drinks were drank. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of drinks were drank. <laughs> That was fun, though. Yes, yes, good time. You had a good crowd, too. Yeah, it was a good crowd. A lot of my friends came out, so now we're just gearing up for uh, this Thursday. Yeah. So, Tell everybody yeah. a little bit about the song. Don't, not the video, because we want them to watch, but uh, just, like, what inspired even the title of the song, because yeah, it's very um, different. So, actually, it's the title track on my new album called Contemporary Folklore. And uh, Contemporary Folklore is just, like, um, I, how I can explain it is... It's a modern way of viewing these like the, these tales that I've e either experienced and kind of made up and kind of just written about and things that have happened. But it's um, it's like modern fairy tales almost, but like nice. very it, it's it's more of a dark fairy tale. I'm talking about like it, it, th there's definitely a dark fantasy it gets to it. It's a little deep and dark. Yeah, okay. it does. It does. It does. <laughs> but but contemporary folklore as a song, it's um, mainly based about uh, my my wedding. Okay. Um, that I had and uh, just about um, kind of being in love and then um, how how things like come together in the end and uh, it's it's more of an epic song I wanted to make it the most beautiful piece of music that I I, I could um, from a production standpoint and the arrangement um, is definitely a different way of of putting a song together I think but uh, but yeah it worked out in the end and it it's did. got it's got it some did. grit but it but it has some like I think b beautiful tones to it. I'm just like, I don't know. I mean, it's like I, singing, a little bit of rapping, like, and that's what exactly. you do in, in everything. Yep. You yep. do both. and Exactly. I love to sing. I love to rap. He's a talented so. guy here. So, yeah. so I mean, cool. it works. It works. So what did you that, think, that B? That beat was sick. Yeah. The beat was you sick. Know, the the, the DJ in ears of me is, you know. Yeah. Okay. The beat was yeah, he's a huge joke. music person. Oh, okay, so. cool, cool. Yeah, that beat was killer. I was like, okay, okay. <laughs> I don't want to say too much about the video either, but it was just a cool setup. I really liked how that shit went. Yeah, yeah you guys got to watch that. Yeah, so we're happy to have you on. You ready to have Thank some you. fun with Oh, us? I'm ready to have some fun. the show gets crazy. <laughs> I've been warned. I have been warned. I have been warned. We're off the chain. So. Everybody's stretching right now because it's like, yeah. we're like getting ready for the yeah. game. I mean. I mean, just from these notes that you already looked at. <laughs> yeah. Um, just for oh. those out there that don't know we don't tell our guests like ahead of time we don't prep them we don't tell you the stories <laughs> this is your first time even like seeing the topics yep. so like we like for the reaction to be genuine mm -hmm. we like for the commentary to be really genuine and that just makes it for a, you know a better show yeah exactly so, let's just dive right on in shall okay. we <laughs> 
Okay. <laughs> so I know everybody saw this. This um, <sighs> divorce. I didn't even know the divorce court still came on TV. Yeah. Like, I didn't even know. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. So divorce court. Um, I didn't know that that was out of Chicago. Did you know that? Yeah. I didn't know that. A lot of the people in divorce court that are in the in the audience, or I guess you, I don't know. I didn't know. We're both they're, from they're, Chicago. So. Yeah. I, I didn't either. I the didn't people know. in the audience are like actors and shit. Hilarious. Oh, so it's, is it fake? Then? The court isn't fake, but the background people are fake. Oh, so they just need, because they need Because they need people, oh. you know. Oh. Who, who really wants to be in court and shit, right? Somebody right, just sitting there. Seen. Yeah, For real, true. I dodged that. I dodged that yeah, shit. me too. Yeah. Would, <laughs> I dodged that shit. Who would want to be there? Yeah. Because you remember when I just had to do jury duty. Oh, uh, yeah. I just horrible. missed mine for jury duty. I hope there's no policeman out there listening to this. They're 22. downstairs <laughs> waiting on you, Chief. <laughs> they tried to put me on a 22-day case. I was like, hell no. So 22 I, days. Yes. I did everything I could to get out of that. <laughs> no got way. out of that. So <laughs> anyway, on divorce court, <laughs> mm-hmm. uh, I think it was this week, right? The episode, um, I don't even know what day this was, but... This girl, <laughs> so a we guy and a girl. This. I think they're so they're clearly they're married because this is divorce court. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Nathan Sellers and Leah Palmquist were on oh, um, very close. <laughs> I know Palmquist. Um. Oh, oh, I don't know her. <laughs> <laughs> Sounding a little close. Oh, it was Friday's episode. Um, mm-hmm. So the guy Nathan accused her of sleeping with the entire Wu-Tang Clan. Who? Who? I cannot. All of them. Bring the motherfucking ruckus. <laughs> all of them. Like, all of them. All of them. <laughs> so she went to a concert, mm-hmm. a Wu-Tang concert, and ended up going back to, like, the, the tour bus and hanging out with them yeah. until, like, 7 a.m. the next day, though. Yeah, she, she said she had, like, a really wild... Mm-hmm. A wild night. A wild night, but nothing happened. That could have been innocent, man. It could have been playing spades it or some been. shit. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. Spades. Hmm. And what year was this? And what year was this? <laughs> this is like last Friday. So, <laughs> so the guy doesn't believe her. So he's like, "Yeah, she gave the woo some clunk, some tang. I'm gonna need she you gave to, the woo some tang. I'm gonna need you to never she say that. I think she woo. gave woo some C R E A M." Yeah, he said she gave the woo some tang, <laughs> but she said she told the judge that she's not a bust down like that. So the judge learned what a bust down was. Oh, Do yeah, you know what a bust down that. is? Nash, um, <laughs> I think the B should break like down a, what I, a bust down is. I, I, I heard down? her say though. I heard her say groupie and bust, and down, bust down, and so that's what. I was like, oh, I, I could put those together. Maybe that's what she meant. Yes. But then, she, didn't she, like, give a definition? I don't know if she, like, gave her own I definition. I didn't watch this entire thing, but in this, it said that she said she wasn't a bust down. A bust down is simply somebody that fucks the fuck. <laughs> <laughs> that's, as simple, that's as simple as it is. On the bus. No. No. Bust. Bust. Now, if she's a bust t- down t- on the bus, then that's some other shit. But oh. no, a bust down is just somebody oh that gets God. down to get down. And it can be because you're famous. So, I mean, so, yeah. like... Not all groupies are bust downs, but there are definitely bust downs that are groupies. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. Oh my you, you know God. what I mean? If that clears yeah. it up a little bit. Oh, wow. I remember in Almost Famous, what, what they call themselves? The Band-Aids? Does anyone remember that? <laughs> no. Damn, no one? Okay. But what does that mean? I mean, that, 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 that's what she said. Uh, um, we're not groupies. We're Band-Aids. All righty then. And how, did they they, the, how did they aid the band? Yeah. What did they do? <laughs> I I'm, I'm curious. I mean, you I know, because that would be a bus we down. Yeah, I mean, that would be a, bu- that's okay. a bus down. Okay. Then yeah. that's a bus down. Yeah. And we're in it. Mm-hmm. Well, she did say that it should be noted that they are nothing to fuck with, whatever that means. Mm-hmm. And they treated her. <laughs> oh, wait, that's amazing. They treated <laughs> her so with dope. respect. She would never cheat on her boyfriend, husband, Gentlemen. or whoever. And, um, oh, they're saying that he's just a boyfriend, but this is divorce court. I'm confused. Anyway. This is saying maybe they've been together seven years in this common law. Yes, so I don't know. So she's just like, I would never do that, and the guy's like, bullshit, you fucked them all, and so (laughs) yeah, this was funny. So if you all didn't see the video, go on YouTube and look it up. It's hilarious. So um, they weren't even in court for that though. Nah, he 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 threw that out there because she came to get him for four stacks. even why they were in court so they had another reason that they were getting she divorced. brought yes. him to court she to sue him, him for thirty five hundred dollars because his dirty ass gave her bed bugs. <laughs> oh. 
<laughs> so that's what this was about. So then he was basically like, you feeling crabs or some other shit. It wasn't bed bugs. It was the Wu-Tang Clan. <laughs> Oh All my of them. God. Exactly. Exactly. There is a, the Jizza. Oh. The Jizza. Inspect the deck. I. <laughs> she inspected the. And all the rest of them. She inspected the deck. You feel me? Too much. <laughs> okay. <I'm laughs> Match is on My bad. I'm yes. Done. I love it. I love it. This is what I we want. I am done with that. I'm done. This is what we want. Oh, this man. Is okay. Oh, my God. <laughs> all right. My bad. So, uh. um, this next one is so disturbing. B, I'm going to let you handle it. Go ahead. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> this is so disturbing. We find what stories this? from this part of the world all the time. Well, at I, least it's not China this time. Which part of I the mean, world? I mean, it's still in Asia. Asia. <laughs> it's still in Asia. A train passenger ejaculated, mm -hmm. ejaculated on more than 100 female commuters. On the train. In, four, in a four-year span. <laughs> <laughs> His face. Oh really? Yeah. What do you even say to that? Oh. <laughs> Basically, oh, he did. like he did. <laughs> yes. He did. So a forty-year-old perv um, in Japan That's was. A picture. You have a picture? Mm -hmm, That's him. He looks like a perv. And <laughs> yeah, so he cut oh, a my. hole in his jacket, and you know, for easy access and all. And yeah, he's just like coming on girls on the train, without them knowing. So they're getting off the train. Can you? Well, you all. That would be gross for you to imagine. They're getting off the train. I couldn't imagine that I'm off getting the, the, off. That I get off the, the train tra and I look down and I just got random come on me. Oh my! Can you? That's how, that's how you that's got how caught. it happened. No, this oh. is exactly how it happened. So a little girl. Uh, well, this is just not a going, little girl. This is going to not a little girl. She's 18. She's still a. She's a, still a little girl. Yeah. She's 18. She noticed it on her skirt and went to oh. the authorities like, hey, don't know where this came from. I was just No pun it. intended. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. So, I didn't even catch it. <laughs> officer, officer, I seem to have a lot of protein on my dress. Yeah. Like, I'm so yeah, she goes from. to the cops like, hey, yeah. just on the train and disappeared. Don't know how. Oh. And because my. they the DNA from it. They got him. Yeah. That's Hold how on, they okay. Caught him. Wait a minute. The only way you can get caught. He had to have done it? something else. He had for to have done to something even. else. Yeah. But what's this hundred? How did they know it was a hundred? Did he? Well, like, he finally he admitted to like, it. Admitted to oh, he it. Yeah. Confessed. I mean, because he got a lot. Like, he I've got been arrested. ejaculating on a hundred women. <laughs> like, since like 2011. <laughs> so for four years. Some people watch sports. <laughs> <laughs> I take the train and, like, what? Who does this? And then another lady came forward. I can't a twenty-six-year-old lady came forward and said the same thing. Like, oh, it happened to me too, but I didn't know who did it. Like, how the fuck would I know that? And so now, like, all of these women, a lot of women were coming out saying, oh, it happened to me. And then he confessed to a lot of it too. But what's your first reaction when you look down and you see just a bunch what of the fuck is this all over your shirt? Like, where, where did I spend the night last seriously, night? Seriously, <laughs> you start questioning yourself. Like, what the fuck? Where did yeah. this come from? Like, really? Cause like you just say you just went to work or school, you know you didn't have sex during that, <laughs> and then you just get on the train. Like you that, know you well. didn't <laughs> during work or school, and then you just get on the train to go home. Yeah. In that time, that's a good way to end up this, in divorce court. How did this get on? Dude? <laughs> yeah, that's you're a right. Great way. That's to a good way to end up in divorce court, honey. I don't know. I don't know. I just got someone came on my on my skirt today who, on the who train. Who believe you, right? Like my dog what? ate my homework. <laughs> The hell, the husband's like, get out of my house. <laughs> oh, I love the husband's voice that he just. That's came. the husband's voice. Get out of my house. Get out of my house. <laughs> <laughs> He's very manly. Yeah, yeah. So the guy, his explanation was, when I, I get excited when in close contact with a woman on a crowded train. Really? Go to a strip club, dude. You can't just do James it at Blunt. home, though. No. Did like, James Blunt write a song about that? Like you're beautiful. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Don't be sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot. I had to. But that is just so sick and twisted to me. That is. What's um, going on in his head when he's doing this? I, I, I don't a know. lot, probably. Is he like, 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 I don't like, know. like, but for real, like, what? Like, what is going on in his head? He's a, it's just, he's messed up, man. He's messed up. I don't know. That's sick. It's just sick. A hundred women, four <laughs> years. I just can't get over it. But okay, whatever. I just want to see the math. Oh, moving on. Um, right. Yes, yes, let's. <laughs> Let's go. 
thorough a nurse in the Czech Republic has admitted to killing six people um, with a massive dose of potassium. But guess why? She was a lazy bitch. <laughs> yeah, basically. Yeah, she, she did it to decrease her workload. Word, so she wanted to go on vacation. B- just kill them. Like, that's just the easiest way to not do any work. I'm just oh. going to kill these people. Would you be surprised to know that that's kind of, I don't want to say it's common, but I got friends that are nurses, and they say some nurses they know will kind of be wow. lazy when they know they should do something for a sick person. They'll be like, oh, Ooh. yeah. And she did, like, she did this to people that were dying anyway. Like, that made it better, but yeah, that was kind of her explanation. Know. Like, I don't want to care for them anymore. I They're mean, dying anyway. Let me just help them. Like, I mean, that's what this was. How'd they find this out? <laughs> it's like just consecutive, like... Well, yeah. Yeah, that's exactly um, what it was. Yo, that's exactly what it was. six of your patients lately, Donna, have uh, died <laughs> um, by by unknown causes. Do you have anything to do with this? She's like putting the whatever it was. What was it? Potassium. It's potassium away. Like, no, 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 no. And we've noticed that this potassium bottle <laughs> is completely empty. Donna, can you explain this? No, no, no. I, I can't explain this. Oh, okay. Well, then it must not be you. They just must have died. And... They dubbed her Nurse Death, so that's her name. That nurse may be Death. the show title this week, Nurse Death. Oh, the Grim Reaper. Yeah, Nurse Grim Reaper, that's her. Um, so she was initially arrested over the death of a 70-year-old woman last August, but then when she was arrested, you're going downhill anyway, girl. You about you locked up. Mm-hmm. So she just admitted to killing the other five people. Like No, fuck. she didn't. She just came clean like that. Yeah. Just. I think she did that so they wouldn't fuck with her in prison. Yeah, because she knows what she can do right. with other yeah, inmates. True. She letting the motherfuckers know. True mm-hmm. that. Don't get sick in my jail. Right. All I need is a <laughs> bunch <laughs> of bananas, bitch, and you're gone. You fucking gone. No. I'm just saying. Bananas. I'm just saying. Oh, oh my God. She's just done. She's just going to keep feeding them bananas over and over and yeah. over again. Feeding them and feeding, feeding them. them and feeding Dude. them. You know what I'm talking about. Oh, my God. <laughs> I can't. And then they're like, oh, well, she's not insane. She knew exactly what she was doing. She is fit to stand trial. You know, this isn't like She's a gonna crazy stand trial. She, she knew okay. what she was doing. She planned it. So, yeah, her ass is going down. She'll likely spend the rest of her life in jail. Where's What's she from? She, is she U.S.? Czech Republic. Oh, Czech, Czech Republic. Republic. That's what you said. Mm-hmm. Look at the last line of the story. Which? One? It's not legal for us to kill people <laughs> ahead of time. No shit. <laughs> I, I don't think not. it's legal anywhere to do that. Well, it did say in Belgium that um, euthanasia was legalized in 2002. That's what it says here. I ain't here. never going there. Yeah. Me neither. Nope. And I know someone Ever. that lived there, actually. But yeah, that's Ever. what it says. It says she would not likely have been prosecuted in Belgium mm. where euthanasia is legal. So. I'm definitely not going there with you. She threatened to kill me three times a week, dog. She did it today before we got here. Probably oh more like I did. I came in and I was like, ooh. She threatened to kill me today. Those are knives in the eyes. Knives in the eyes. I did threaten to kill him too. And, and, and you know the reason why? You know the reason why? Listen, if anything happens, <laughs> and if you get hurt, I know a really good nurse. <laughs> <laughs> She's going to be locked up, Joe. She yeah. can't get to me. Why did I even threaten you? I don't even remember. Because I do it so much. She threatened me know. because she didn't like the way I passed the menu towards her. In the oh. restaurant that we met in for a meeting. How did yeah. he pass it? Exactly. He basically was like, no. yeah, in my face. Mm-hmm. Right. It's okay. It's okay. And I just. We can like, handle this in I politely, radio divorce court. I politely said. Tuesdays at 9 p.m. I, I will kill you. <laughs> this fucking guy. That's why you're sitting there, actually. <laughs> that's why you're sitting there. Oh, you put him in the middle because you know I won't hit him? No. Yeah, well, pretty oh, much. So I'm, blo- I'm the block. Yeah, okay. I mean, you can, you can handle it. On the wall. You can handle it. Yeah. Okay. I can't hit him. Okay. See? I haven't known him long enough. Yeah. See? Just give it some time, though. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Look, he's, he's like, mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> well, B, you may like this story. Why the fuck would I like this story? Well, Which I'm one's this? Saying. There's Isn't a this guy, like every man's dream? No, not really. There's a guy in Los Angeles, so out this way. Los Angeles. lives happily with two girlfriends in the house together, and they share a California king size bed and blah blah blah, but like they're on, in a polyamorous relationship and they're happy. Not more. Fuck m- that. <laughs> Kids are involved. Yeah, like, they got like a whole fucking weird they're ass like, family. And they're not married. They just they're a thruple. That's what they call them. Thruple. Oh, would, there they are. I would never say that word, but it says it here. Thruple. 
That's it what sounds they like they were, you know, him and his girlfriend were experimenting one night. It was like, hey, let's invite mm, Becky nope. over. And then they were like, wow, let's, we really like this. Like, let's, let's all just say be it's actually way worse than that. So okay. he was married. <laughs> Thought I was. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Damn, right. Worse. He okay. was married. Mm hmm. And um, so he started dating his wife's friend. Yeah. <laughs> Liked her a little bit more than the wife. While he was married. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. So he was cheating on his wife and um, started dating her friend. Well, s not dating, seeing her like creeping with her friend. Okay. Liked her more than the wife, was seeing her more than the wife, left the wife. Okay. To be with this girl, Brooke. And um, they formed a relationship. But then they met Lynn. Who was oh. cool and she was down. She's bisexual and she's like, Yeah, I want to be a part of this couple. All right. Yeah, let's just live all together. So, yeah, that's how that went down. So, yeah, he was married, bored, left his wife, fucked the friend, and then they found another one to join in and then they all just moved in together. And yeah, one big happy family. And it's then they aren't polygamists. They are. Yeah, they are then. They're polygamous. Yeah, they I mean they're that. not married, but yeah. yeah I, I guess so. I still don't understand why you think I would be down for some stupid. I didn't shit say like you this. would be down. I'm just, just men in general tend they to want, want to. multiple. No. Women. Yes, no, two the, women at the same the time. Thought of, is the what thought I'm of a threesome is cool, so but then them bras that. gotta go. But like I'm not trying to I'm live saying. with them and shit. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> Word. <laughs> the threesome is cool, but then, no, I'm not finna get up and make you bacon and eggs and shit. Get the fuck out of my house. Like, it's, it's over with. <laughs> oh <my> Word. <laughs> I'm good. That, that is, that's not a ah, I don't think that. anybody in here would want to do some you're shit right, like you're that. You're right. That's, that's double ridiculous. the pancakes. That's double the pancakes. Nick said, no. Nah. Exactly. Nah. Hugh Hefner does it, and he seems to love it. <clears throat> Hugh yeah. Hefner's old as shit. But he was doing it when he was younger. Yeah. So, yeah. I mean, don't make it seem I mean, like no man would be like polygamy is real. Like people do that's this a real shit thing on a regular. What's like, the TV what show? Are you talking What's about? the TV Make show? love. No. Make love. Yeah, Make you watch love. that? I watch it. Yeah. No, I yeah, know it's real, or it wouldn't be a term for. Like, it, but you try to. You looked at me like I would be interested because in that shit. Because you're a pervert. That's Fuck why. that. <laughs> Fuck that shit. I'm the wall. I'm the wall. <laughs> you're a pervert. Fuck all of that, man. So you know, I don't even want to hear about other motherfuckers doing that shit. It pisses me off. This is a waste really? of time. Yeah, That's this guy. What's his name? What's his name? What is his name? Let's see here. His name. Hmm. The girlfriend is Jane and no, Adam, oh, Lyons. Adam Lyons. Oh, fuck Adam Lyons. So Brooke and Lynn. <laughs> oh, no. Jane and Brooke are. Oh, Jane. Yeah. The girlfriends. Playing and Jane and basic one Brooke. Of them. Playing Jane and basic Brooke. And he is hilarious. And Adam. Fucking Adam. Lyons. Okay. And Adam. <laughs> So Brooke already had a child and then like from a previous relationship, but she just recently had a kid oh, with no. Adam. Oh. And then Lynn just Why kids. I keep calling her fucking Lynn? Jane. Jane. <laughs> oh, it's too many people. It's too many Plain. people. <laughs> Jane wants to have a child to bring into like the family too. Um, so she's like working on getting pregnant. Damn. And they have separate date nights. So, yeah, while he's out with one, the other's at home. I guess keeping the kids. They better move um, to <laughs> Vegas. This is twisted. I can't. This I is just, twisted. It's, it's a lot. They don't tie um, this knot. No. 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 I'm, I'm, I'm just not no. sharing. I'm just, I can't. I'm not doing that. Yeah. No, no one wants to share. <laughs> if I'm Ooh, sharing you, I don't know about it. That's funny. <laughs> I don't know about it. I mean. <laughs> when you live with somebody and you the dude, you already giving up a lot of stuff, okay? Now you got two of the same somebody there. You ain't going to have no closet space, mm -mm. no bathroom time. Mm -mm. Get a big I can't house. Think, you ain't going to be able to play video games mm -mm. and shit. You ain't going to be able to do none of the stuff you like. Mm -mm. Fuck that. No. And then his kids involved. And then his kids involved. <laughs> you got two women, two kids. It sounds stressful. So that, that, so that, like that, that, that 350Z sounds... you you used to drive, <laughs> nigga. Now you got a van. I'm straight. You no, know, <laughs> keep it. Yeah, that keep sounds it. stressful. Keep it. <laughs> Nobody wants to deal with that. Well, they're happy. So good for them. I yeah, mean, yeah. Happily, happily is the, the term there. Whatever works. Tito. Hashtag. To <laughs> each their own. <laughs> That's that's your that's your hashtag. That's my hashtag. Okay, so we gotta use that. Tito, T E T O. <laughs> Nash is crazy. Oh my god! All right, B. What's this next one? A guy in Wyoming steals a train. Joy rides with the train. 
Who steals a train? It's a fucking train. Like, Speed. But it's a Kiana. mining train, so it's not like. Oh, it's my not, God. Oh, he's like this? Like, uh, like, I'm like, do <laughs> I don't even, know if it's that small. <laughs> not the Indiana go, Jones joints, but <laughs> yeah. But, but do they even go fast? Like. They go fast enough. They said he was running into other miners with it and shit. <laughs> no. So not only did you steal the train. <laughs> He's playing bumper cars You're with the fucking train. You're hitting like other trains. Yeah, miners. Oh, my Damn. God. They arrest him. They fine him $63,000. And in court, he goes, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to do that. Like I've how, many, how much? 63 stacks. That's $63,000. And he was on like probation. Yeah. Look at that guy. Yeah, he looks crazy. He looks like someone that's gonna steal a motherfucking train. Well, it's in Wyoming, so I mean, what else they got to do there? True. What else is in Wyoming? Anybody ever been there? No. I've never been to Wyoming. That sounds boring. Ain't never no. <laughs> no one no. ever been to Wyoming. No. Huh? See, exactly. That's mm-hmm. why they steal trains there. Yeah, that's why there's mines there. They obviously don't have razors. Look at this dude's face. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. Look at this face. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God. That's Wyoming. Why did he steal the train? He was mad, right? He was mad at his boss. He was mad at his boss. I think I've got the black lung, pop. <laughs> Give me the fucking train. <laughs> <laughs> I'm never talking to you guys again. Like, and I can just imagine him doing <laughs> Right? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> He just looks like that. Like you guys have been working me too hard. Like how you get mad at your boss, steal the train, and then try to fuck up other people and trains, and <laughs> then when you're in court, you're like, probably should that, that wasn't a good idea. Like Mm-mm. I'm sorry. There's what? better ways to get back at your boss, bro. I mean, there is. seriously. Judge Judy is gonna have to handle that one. Oh my <laughs> god, this guy. Bad joke. <laughs> <laughs> You recognized it. I did. So, I did. I called myself. As long as you recognize it, it's fine. <laughs> All right. So do this last one. You got to do this last one. I she's just, from Chicago. Man. I know. And that's what I'm like. Why must you be from where we are? So this woman was arrested for beating herself up. Yep. She, and she beat herself so bad. She looked like Quasimodo in the pictures. Look at this look shit. At look at her, real, her head. Like, oh, my <laughs> God. Look at her head. <laughs> look at that. She it's hit like herself a, in the head with a fucking crowbar oh, repeatedly. That's like some real Jim Carrey shit from Liar Liar. Yeah, yeah. it's really bad. She hit herself with a crowbar Word. and started <laughs> running into the wall with her head. Um, when the cops came to try to calm her down, she was like p- punching herself in the breast and the stomach. Calling herself a pussy. Yeah, like take that pussy. And like, yeah, she's like, oh. but only because her stepfather they were it was a bet right a 12 dollar bet 12 dollars a 12 dollar bet because he challenged her and was like i bet you couldn't kick your own ass whoa 12 dollar bet they must have been drunk <laughs> no nah, they was high okay high <laughs> then he turned on her ass because she got arrested for like fucking the house up and then he sued her <laughs> like the stepfather is a <laughs> dick <laughs> like you're an asshole so you like put her up to this right and then <laughs> what? You turn on her, <laughs> sue her because she fucked your house up, and you press charges? Come but on. Why oh. Why was it only 12 Like, that's a weird $12 lower. bet? I know, that is weird. That like, must like be like extra value meal she, cost or something, a Taco Bell. Well, she has to be co- off. She must have needed that $12. What the fuck were you going to do with $12? Like, what are you going to do with $12? Dude, and she's 33 years old. How like, are you going to fix those damages? I mean, she's, she's 33. Never gonna... This isn't like... A child, you know, she's not young. No, no, no. Something clearly is off here for her. So like, yeah. For $12, girl, like, this is what you do? Okay. <laughs> and she kept doing it till the cops shot her with a stun gun. They couldn't <laughs> calm her down. They couldn't calm her down. Oh, wow. Because she was like, I in a rage. She said that I knew that I could beat myself up. Um, even <laughs> though I'm pretty tough, I really wanted to show him that I wasn't afraid of myself girl why yeah. don't you just beat his yeah. ass and take the 12 dollars yeah you I go would. girl you pay it yeah you, you go beat your, own you beat ass. your ass yeah what? good job you really proved a point she's got a fucking pumpkin head now that's just not ass. gonna go down <laughs> like this is crazy oh, that is no that's disgusting i mean that's hills have eyes <laughs> <laughs> i saw that i saw that movie <laughs> they cast it no this is they cast it for that <laughs> Oh that's Hills Have Eyes. She's like an extra in Hills Have Eyes. Yeah, oh, my God. Like a, if she wanted to pose in a picture, would you say she's a fan? You going to do it? If, if she wanted to pose with me? Yeah, you know how fans rock run up to you and they want to take Yeah, do I sign that bump on her head? <laughs> 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 
yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, you want an autograph? All right, but well, well, may, maybe not a photo. Okay. Oh, yeah. Let me sign that. All right, cool, cool, cool. Yeah, have a good one. Take oh. care of yourself, girl. <laughs> and then she's in the front oh row God. of your show. Yeah. Oh, man, that's not the... Like, Just, you're like... <laughs> it'll throw him completely yeah, yeah. off. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh. I can't. I can't. Oh, oh my god well that's all we have time for for this segment okay okay <laughs> damn oh. yeah these topics so we're gonna have some fun with you um oh really b came up with lyrics that we're going to we're testing you well what that, oh. b is gonna do this like he's Fuck. gonna say the lyrics because he knows all the shit i don't and you have to say the artist Okay. <laughs> Who made this? So I have to pull it up too. And I, pu- I pulled obscure shit because I mean clearly he knew Wu Tang um, references and shit, yeah. so he knows his music. So I couldn't give you anything easy. Oh man. Okay. <laughs> He's okay. like fuck. <laughs> I'm gonna have to think. I don't know. Maybe. Go ahead. And all I want to know is who the artist is. Yeah, you don't have to be like. I don't give a fuck about the song when song, it came out. Just what verse? Yeah. I just want to know who the artist is. Okay. <clears throat> <clears throat> I got cheddar to blow. My pockets never get low. Bitches sweat me wherever I go. Jay Z. Mm, close. Say it again. Really? Close, but no. Say it again. Cheddar to blow. I got cheddar to blow. My pockets never get low. It's very obscure. I wouldn't even know what it was if I didn't go back and Fuck. listen to my shit. I don't even know this person. I know this person. You know this person. I know. I know you this. You clearly person. know this person. I don't. I ain't yeah, never heard. Can I tell him? Can I tell no, him? No, no. Wait, wait. He's like, wait. Give me a chance. Give me a chance. Hold up. <laughs> Hold on. Here. You know this person. I know you know this person. I don't know it. I'll give you a clue. He ain't alive no Get- more. Oh, but okay. he ain't Pog and he ain't Big. So Word. Oh, oh, Big L. See, there you go. <laughs> I don't know that who the is, fuck yes, Big L is. Big L. Yes. I don't know who that is. So, all right, all right. Life's, you got that, that one. Rich and Danger. Yeah. 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 He was on an album with mm-hmm. another guy, Cool G Rabbit. Yep. Nah, no, I've heard, heard him. Song. Okay. That's tight. Okay. How many more do we have? We got a lot of them on here. You want to read some? No. Fine. Because <laughs> I don't know any of them. <clears> These <throat> are racking my brain right now. Okay. <laughs> my, sh- my shit too bright. I rip through mics. Plus, I push more powder. Than crystal light. Damn. <laughs> He's like shit. I know you know this. You have to know this. If you can, if you know anything about Wu Tang, you know this dude. I can't give you a clue about this guy though. He's just way too yeah. fucking famous. I mean, Old ODB. No. no, he's way too fucking famous, and he's not Wu Tang. Top rapper. Oh, oh, I thought you were saying. Oh, top rapper. He's way like, too fucking famous. Top of his game, like crystal light. This is older shit though. Yeah, this is like it's his earlier shit. stuff. Wait, say it again. Damn it, man. I can't read these, this little print. Okay. <laughs> My shit too bright. I rip through mics. Plus, I push more powder than the crystal, crystal light. light. It happens shit. to be one of my favorite lyrics. You know, huh? I don't know. <laughs> Wait. We got other people in here to know. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, I'm going to give you yeah. a big hint. No, 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 no. I don't need a big hint. Oh, then, yeah. Uh, Oh, uh, no, I'm, I'm just going to throw it earlier. It's Jay-Z, yeah. Okay, uh, I'm like, I you too. said it earlier. <laughs> I was like, oh, wait, hold up. Hold like up, a hold big up. Rapper Top dude. of the game here. Huge, yeah. Sorry, it got me sweating. <laughs> no, it's because I got this leather jacket on. I'm, <laughs> I'm hella calm and cool and collected under this shit. That shit is fresh, this shit. too. <laughs> oh I, think you should, I think he should leave that behind when we, when we... You can't fit that. I can sell it. Oh, my God. Next lyric. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> Lucille. Won't you do your sister's will? Oh, Lucille. <laughs> Won't you do your sister's will? That's all I'm going to say. I'm sure you know this guy already. Pretty easy. Well, you ran away and left. I love you I still. Love you still. Lucille. Lucille. <laughs> Lucille. <laughs> Why don't I know this? Do you know this? I know you know it. It's not a rapper. But we I know, I know it's not a rapper. Like, clearly, it's not a rapper. I know it's not a rapper. <laughs> a song. <laughs> I, I, just say it. Say it. I'm sorry, I guys. know you know it. I know you know it. Uh, God, I'm flopping right now. Otis Redding. Yeah. Otis Redding. Not one of the there big. Uh, it was pretty big. It was a pretty big Otis Redding song, but not like the ones that. Right. Yeah. 
You're doing good. Killing though. me, guys. No, you guys are killing me. But you got Big L on your own. We didn't okay, tell you okay, that. Okay, right, right. We gave you hints for Jay Z, but you still said it. Like, we didn't yeah, say you, it. Yeah, you made it hard. No, it's okay. <laughs> I warned you. You warned me. You actually warned me before. Like, that's only Nash, what two more. I'm gonna rip you apart. We got a couple. We got a couple of them. There's only what two more. Yeah. My favorite girl wouldn't leave me just because I got a girlfriend. My freak girl told me now she a Christian. My white girl. A con- con- Kanye West. Yeah. yeah. See? See? Like, I see, that's I, one of my favorite verses yeah. from him. I love that. Hmm. Hmm. What else do we have it's here? Just one more. Hmm. Okay. Right? Oh, it's two more. I, I got a couple of them in It's here. just two more. She's there to love me both day and night. Never grumbles or fusses. Always treats me right. It's a song, not she a rap. Came yeah. Money. Yeah, this, but this isn't. I'm a knee. I mean, wait, she's free to love me. Uh, right? Sing it, so. Right, he's singing yes. it for you. The original. Yeah, that's the original, though. Mm-hmm. That's I can't what do this the snake is. For too long. So, who sang uh, the original? Oh, my gosh. Um, There's a movie made about him. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> I'm giving um, hints. I'm helping. Yeah, it's, uh, it's uh, Ray Charles. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, guys. Damn. He's like, fuck. Damn. Ray Charles. He's like, why are you doing this Robin, to me? Rob, Rob's shaking his head. He's like, oh, Lord. You're doing good, Nash. Oh, Lord. You're doing know good. Know yourself. Know your worth. <laughs> <laughs> know your worth. <laughs> he put him in a hot seat. Okay, just one more. I don't. Okay, one more. I was born by the river. I was born by the river in a little town. I was born by the river. Yes. If you don't sing it, then you know who it is. Um, you know the song, clearly. I do I do know the song. I think he's just drawing a blank with the artist. I, I think he's scared. I, I am drawing a blank. I got a little nervous. <laughs> I am drawing a blank. Look at that. My forehead is shining. My forehead shining. Oh, my God. Um. Damn. The thing <laughs> is, at least you know it, is what damn. I'm saying. You know who all these artists are. You know all of them. I know. You know who this guy is. Sam Cooke, man. Yeah. <laughs> Come on. But let the good you, times roll. But you knew the song. I so. did. I did. Man, but that, you know what, though? That Did he write that song, though? Is that know. an original Sam Cooke song? I don't know. Now that's that I don't that's know. That's what I'm trying to think I of. I don't know that history. I know people took his shit and redid it, but I'm not sure. If, yeah. I'm not really familiar with. Because I know. If he would a lot of singers have sung that song, mm-hmm. but, but yeah, you're right. Sam Cooke definitely sang that as well. So, but but I do w- love Sam Cooke. But you I write can. all of your songs. I do write Correct. all of my songs. <laughs> so that's good to know. Yes. You write everything, and um, <laughs> on your album, Contemporary Folklore. Are you working? You're working on a new album right now, right? I am working on a new album right now. Um, I know you can't it's, tell it's us. It's not titled or anything. Right, I'm like, anything. I know you can't tell us a lot about that right But we've been now. jamming to some stuff lately that, yeah, I'm actually going to play on Thursday a track from the new from the new album. And where is the show on Thursday? Uh, it's at the Silver Lake Lounge in Silver Lake. I'm down. So We're going. We will be there. Yeah, you guys got to come. Nine o'clock. Man, I won't. There's no trivia at the show. <laughs> It's like, don't be like it's not a trivia drilling night. me. No, this is a live show. <laughs> Nash Quest performing in LA. So make sure you all come out to Silver Lake Lounge. Yeah, it's going to be something definitely unexpected. And the place is cool. It's a little dive bar, but we're going to pack the shit out of that place. It's yeah. going to be really dope. It's going to be really gonna, dope. You're going to do the song that we saw in the video, right? That's a badass fucking I mean, song. I want to hear I, that shit live. Yeah, I mean, may, maybe. Come, you got to come. It might be, it might be in the set. You gotta come out and check it out and see dope. what it he's might gonna be in do. The set. That song was so dope. The wall comes out. <laughs> he's like, I ain't giving shit away. I'm gonna look at him too. I'm gonna look at him. I'm gonna throw my panties at your ass. <laughs> 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 like, wow. He's gonna throw that shit right back at you. Like, right. mm. who was this? <laughs> <laughs> what is all this protein going on? Yeah. Oh, oh my oh. god. Oh. Mm-hmm. Get out of here. Oh. Oh. Get out of here. What's all the protein? But I have a serious question for you. Okay, what's up? <laughs> Okay, so who's saying you're Nash Quest? I am, but superstar Nash Quest, like famous, top of the chart, like everything, right? You're on stage performing, and Madonna kisses you. <laughs> <laughs> what do you do? Best believe I kiss her back. <laughs> 
Well, That's you have like Drake's reaction. <laughs> Did you see that? You can't question it, you know? But you saw oh, that, yeah. right? Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah. How insane was that? I mean, it was nuts. I mean, what, like, His what reaction do you do, you know? was like a little mortified. I don't know. You can't. He was taken back. Yeah. I mean, he wasn't expecting it, mm -hmm. but... Um, the memes that are out online right now. Oh, I haven't seen any. We got to look some. Oh, <laughs> are, are they bad? Are the they, New they're... Yorker, dude. Did you see? The New Yorker did um, Show me. a sketch. And it's Drake curled up in like the, his his knees are like he's curled up in a chair. And then there's like a doctor with a, a doll. And he's like, now point to the doll and show me where Madonna kissed you. <laughs> It's, oh, it's so fucked oh. up, dude. Like, oh my god, what? shit's hilarious. People have been going in, like, yeah. so, on so you think this it's, whole situation. I mean, Madonna does what she does. I mean, <laughs> that's she all that does, she does. But it, it's just like, like people are like saying she sucked the soul out of him, and because she grabbed his, like, she pushed his head back. Like and just went in, and he's kind of fighting or whatever. He's pushing her head. It's like it's like a it's like a cartoon. Oh my god! I'm trying to pull it up, but am like, I the only person in here that would uh, would like that? To out this is still Madonna. Yeah, man. that's what I'm saying. I but have you have still you still seen Madonna, Madonna lately? Though she no, I've never got to meet her. All I remember is Material Girl Madonna. But so see, in my yeah, head, thinking, that's Material Girl no, Madonna kissing me. It's not not old same. Madonna. It's not, not that's grandma what Madonna. That's what it's saying. material it's still Madonna. Madonna. It's still Madonna. Yeah. Listen. With he cone, said that. With the cone bra. Yeah. <laughs> okay, she's so not that Madonna anymore. I need you guys to focus on. We all on get older. We all get older. <laughs> who she is. But, um, I mean, he, he, he tried to clean it up and was like, no, it wasn't the kiss. It was more like her lipstick, the taste of her lipstick. I'm like, Drake, I need Drake, you. Drake, you don't care about the lipstick, like, man. Come he on. He wasn't feeling it. He wasn't feeling it. He said he wasn't disgusted by it, and it was her lip, the taste of her lipstick or some shit. But, but he didn't like it. It was bullshit. I'm going to have to pull the picture up for you after because I can't find it right now. But I'll go look up memes tonight. <laughs> oh, my God. It's hilarious. Just go on Instagram and put in, like, Drake or Madonna, Coachella, like, whatever, and it's hilarious. So, so here's our question. Now now do they do it again next week? What? The The kiss. No, <laughs> gross. Drake gonna find a reason not to beat her. Yeah, I don't think he's down. He's trying to get out of this whole mm -hmm. PR mess right now because you can't hide the reaction. Like, yeah, yeah. It's on video, like it's in pictures, and that people poor are guy. going in. That now, poor I do feel, guy. I feel bad. I feel bad because he doesn't. I don't know if he wants that for his image. You know. Yeah. Who cares? It's Drake. Drake can kiss whoever the fuck That's he wants. He's still gonna get the baddest chicks after the fact. True. true. And it's Madonna. <laughs> We're like, true, true, yeah. It's Madonna, yeah. man. It's not like Madonna's kind of gross. It's now, not though. Macy Gray. I mean, it's Madonna. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, just so mean. I mean mm. When I dream <laughs> of you, it's like it's that. It's fucking Madonna. I play my Kubota. <laughs> <laughs> I try to say, say goodbye, goodbye my child. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Trey. It's Madonna, though, man. You're right. You're okay, right. I'm going to show you how Madonna really looks now because you clearly don't know. I don't want to know. No, don't I kill want, this no, for me. No, I'm going Please to. Please don't kill it for he me. He has this image in his no. head. She hasn't aged since Dick Tracy. Don't. Just don't. Bull. Leave it alone. <laughs> <laughs> Leave it alone. What year is this? This was like nine, 89, 90. All right? No, she what year are same. we in now? Good year. You, right now we're in 89 and 90 because we're talking about Madonna. We're not going we not Ron, going. how old is Madonna? You know that she, she's old as fuck right now. And she's old, she but she can still it. move. How old is Madonna? She can okay. move. Now, she has a nice body. What? She does have a nice body. How old is she? <laughs> she said prehistoric. <laughs> <laughs> wow. She's petrified. <laughs> Listen, the shit was funny. So I'm like, I wonder what funny. Nash would do in this situation. I'd just, I'd let it happen. You would just let it go. Like, you would just. <laughs> Sorry, Madonna. Let it ride. Okay. Look, if it ever happened. And then I turn to the audience and be like, Dad, did everybody see that? I'm going to kiss my Madonna. <laughs> if it ever happens where she rolls up in her, her old folks walker and tries to kiss you or whatever else she does. And you don't want that to happen. <laughs> and, and she's so old that like her lipstick's like She not comes up on there with the walker with the tennis balls on the bottom and she's yeah. leaning in to kiss you. And you don't want that to happen. You look over at me, call a timeout. 
Call yeah, a timeout. I'll stand in for you. Don't worry about that. It's Madonna. Oh, okay. <laughs> All okay. right. B. Walt's going to stand it's in for Madonna. me. He's saying this now. I'm telling you. Because when I like, I'm just going to text Hopefully you I get to that level. Her randomly tomorrow. You won't see it coming. And I'm going to scare the <laughs> fuck out of you. Watch. I'm going to send him a picture of Madonna and how she really looks without the makeup and all that shit. And it's going to terrify you. And you're going to change your mind about what the fuck you're saying right now. I stand by what I said. Okay. We'll see. Cool. We will see. And we're going to discuss cool. this next week. I stand and by what I said. We shall see, <laughs> sir. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> Nash, is there anything else you want to share with everyone? Oh, just um, tell you know, everyone how to find yeah, you. Yeah, just and all on that Instagram, good stuff. Nash Quest, Twitter, Nash Quest. Uh, go on to Spotify or iTunes and get the music. Get the music download contemporary Nash folklore com and learn more about you. Yes, and we've got more videos on the way. We have the live show Thursday. At the Silver Lake Lounge, 9 p.m. You guys got to come through. I can still get in, right? You can let me in? Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> After you quiz them and shit. Like. No, <laughs> no, yeah, you're, you're okay. You're okay. But I'm going to be ready for you. <laughs> <laughs> you should call <laughs> his ass out. <laughs> anyway, yeah. So, yeah, come come through. Hit me up on Instagram and Twitter, Nash Quest. And what have you been getting into in L.A.? You've been having some fun. Oh, my gosh. We have had hanging fun. Hanging out and everything. That's yep, good. yep, yep. We got into a few fun parties the other day and uh, just been networking rehearsing, and networking, people, recording. Yeah. Um, it's been pretty cool. I'm nice. like really excited. I have a dope, 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 dope team behind me who are just really kicking ass. And we just, you know, kicking ass, taking names like we're trying to. We're trying. We're on the come up right now, and it's like crazy the momentum that we're building. So and that's how it is. And what can we expect, like, just from you? And if you like, what are your goals in the future? And is music the only thing that you want to do? Do you want to get into other stuff? Maybe um, some acting down the line. I don't know. Oh yeah, see, m music. I'm trying to just focus on music right now. Um, yeah, acting's cool. You know, any any form of art is cool to me. Mm -hmm. But um, as far as how to you know, impact a culture. I, I want to, I want to do it through music, and uh, it's something I have a tough time not doing. Right. So now it's just trying to gain momentum, trying to, you know, get on these on a tour, trying to do um, yeah, a lot of dope. stuff. And and we're not even trying right now. We are like doing. You're doing it. it. You know, we yeah. are like doing it. <laughs> You're doing it. And so you know, expect us like hopefully we're coming to your city and um, yeah, just you know keep updated because we got a lot of things in the works. So. I'm pretty pumped. Well, and yeah, fe festivals, you know, I mean, we're oh, going to get into some festivals. and got to get you yeah, to Coachella just, and yeah, Lollapalooza. Making out, yeah, making out with Madonna. Yeah. <laughs> making out with Madonna on stage, mm -hmm. all of that good stuff. Yeah, so. It'll happen. We definitely know that ah, that's thank in, you. in the works right now. Yes. So can't wait to see more thank of you so everything much. that you're doing. We're fans. Ah, uh, <laughs> so, cool. I put your uh, music on Spotify. I saved it to okay. my Spotify. So I was actually listening to it at home yesterday. Okay, cool. <laughs> and it'll like randomly come on in the car because I keep my playlist running. So thank you. You know, heavy rotation over here. Okay. So yeah, we got to get B. We got to get you the music. So. We'll yeah, get you. I watch the videos. iTunes. You watch the videos. Download though. his shit on iTunes. You know what? <laughs> He'll do it do right it now. now. No, like he really would. <laughs> I dare you, daughter. I dare you to download that on <laughs> iTunes. Twelve dollars. She's like, I'd rather kick my own ass. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, dad. I'd rather kick my own ass than download that. Oh music. my god. Well, this has been fun. Thank this you so much fun. for coming yeah, out. Yeah, you guys rock. As usual, follow us on Facebook, Social Misconduct Radio, Instagram, Social Misconduct, Twitter, Social Misconduct, and just follow our uh, website, socialmisconduct.com. All of the archives, the videos are on YouTube, so go to our YouTube page, Social Misconduct, and you can see mm -hmm. last week's episode. That was our first video. You're our first guest on video, actually. Oh, what? Yes, yeah, so... You know, that's a good thing. I don't know what that was. What was that? What was that? We cut that, right? Oh, my. no, 
no, this is live. You're live uh, right now. Damn, so we, we don't can't, edit can't here. Cut that. Yeah, that's that, not really that how happened. I dance. That happened, but you we'll forget me? about it. It's fine. <laughs> I'll bring it up. I'll bring it up. Yeah, he'll bring time. it up again. And we also are still putting the audio on um, iTunes and SoundCloud. So if you can't watch it or you have a friend or you're on the go, you can listen Great. to it in the car. So it's everywhere. So people yeah. can replay this. Okay, cool. You can share it with all of your fans yeah. tomorrow, sir. And thanks, if, everybody out there for listening. It means a lot. And what yeah. You, oh, he's downloading it right you now. I got a shitty signal in here, but yeah, I'm getting it. Oh, we look got at that. It. We got the music going right now. Do you, can I can I can I like copy the video somehow and put it on my phone? Just uh, go to Vivo. Fine. Just go to I Vivo. Download Vivo? the Vivo app. Oh, okay. See, you know. Yeah, you can just Shout out to Vivo. Vivo. <laughs> yeah. If there's not anything like, else. I'm like download guys. that. Oh no, there's nothing else. Anything right. else be blabbering. that we forgot about or No, I'm looking forward to Thursday though. Yeah, guys, I'm gonna, it's going to be hella fun. Cool. Silver Lake Lounge, 9 p.m. Don't forget, Nash Quest. <laughs> if nothing else, same place, same time next week. Boom. Peace. Peace. You're listening to Social Misconduct with Mick and B-Wall, only on L.A. Talk Radio.